Wabash Valley is finally on the other side of the first snow of the year, but drivers are still noticing some icy and potentially dangerous areas. Taylor Johnson took a ride today with the Vigo County Highway Department. She joins us now live in Vigo County with how they've been treating the roads and how soon we can expect to see them all cleared up. Taylor. Well, Mike, I'm out here in Vigo County right off of US 41, and as you can see, there is still plenty of snow on the ground. But the good thing is, is that there is a lot less on the roads, and that's because departments like the Vigo County Highway Department put tons of sand and salt on the streets today to get them back to normal. New Vigo County resident Scott Martin was in for a surprise after moving from California just a week ago. I've been away from snow for 20 plus years, so, you know, to me it was fun. But what isn't so fun is road conditions. People were driving a lot slower. The side roads are pretty icy. Because of that, the Vigo County Highway Department is working around the clock to get the roads safe. Doing snow, we, it's, uh, we're out all day long. Of course, I'm so far over here, you know, it takes a while to get back and fill back up and come back out here. Normally, we work from 7.30 to 4. That's a normal shift, you know. Then, you know, anytime weather comes in, we try to adapt to the weather and what's coming in. One truck, driven by Gary Beasley, drops around 10 tons of sand and salt through the county. That's Raleigh Township's what I do. Uh, there's a uh, Prairie uh, Township. Uh, Lenton Township. NDOT's got, you know, the major highways. You know, they do like 41, 63, you know, 246, 159 in my area. And then, then everything in between, in between that is the county, county roads. The road supervisor says Monday's snow and overnight temperatures presented a challenge. You, know, you got problem areas about every one of our roads that were the wind open areas that just blows across and it just freezes and you can't really do anything with it because the snow is going to keep on, you know, blowing across. And Scott Martin says their hard work after the snow is paying off. I enjoyed it and I, uh, the roads aren't bad now. Now, Mike, the Vigo County Highway Department tells me that when it snows, they usually start with the main roads and then they work on the secondary roads and subdivisions. And I'm sure everyone wants to know when are roads expected to be clear, and they say that's going to be tomorrow. That's good news. Uh, I'm also wondering how long does it take before people can see a difference in the roads after they treat it? So as soon as they drop the treatment onto the roads, they say it takes about 30 minutes for people to see a difference.